As you can see, nearly there, not quite. I've got a, a brake line there, which needs disconnecting. Hang on a sec. Just show you it with this light. So we've got a brake line there. That still needs disconnecting. But as you can see, all that stuff over there is all off, isn't it? Okay, there's the steering and the exhaust. Had to cut off the front section here, so I haven't got the ability to lift the car over it. A low bearing member, but still doesn't matter. And there's all the emptiness. You can't see it because of the uh, radiator being in the way, but there you go, that's, that's obviously disconnected. And the only thing that's remaining at the moment is the, uh, the brake line. That's it. That's dropped on the floor, it's dropped off the actual uh, uh, Yeah. What I'm going to try and do is tie it on so I can drag it all out once I've disconnected the brake lines. Yeah, but we're nearly there. That's the bit that I actually want, that bit there. That's the transmission. Underneath there is also another motor which I'm going to take out and actually put on... Uh, let me show you it. So, here we have an engine. Where's it gone? There it is. Uh, okay, so that's the Fiat 126 engine. That's a 650cc engine. Right, and I'm going to use that because it's quite a simple engine, which came out of that from there. <laughs> the gearbox and all that stuff there. <coughs> so it came off that, and I'm going to put it onto the motor that's attached to the engine there. Now that's a 1300 engine. It's a 1500 engine with about a power of a 1300. Okay, and I'm going to replace it with a 650 because it can constantly power it, you see. And then the other motor from that is going to be the one that powers the wheels. So, there we go. Bit of a mess at the moment. But there's not much we can do about that at the moment. Anyway, I'm going to finish because it's 7 o'clock on a Sunday. So I'm out of here.